Hi, we're excited to announce the launch of the new viewer role today. So what was the opportunity that we followed here? Uh, we learned from a lot of IT admins that they absolutely don't want too many users with edit permissions in the system. Because they know from experience that when that happens, things start going wrong. We also learned from users that some of them, some types like product managers, analysts, executives, don't even want to have the ability to make changes. They just, they just want to view the data and analytics. Um, they feel safer when they know they can't break anything. So the solution for this was quite straightforward uh, to provide a new type of role, the viewer role. And this role prevents users that have that role from making any changes, very straightforward. The benefits are obvious. Um, the faster onboarding is possible because IT admins have less to worry about and no reason to exclude potential split users anymore. Also, engineers aren't bottlenecks anymore uh, because users like analysts or product managers don't come to them anymore and disrupt their flow. Um, they now can self-service and go into split and get the data about rollouts and analytics and experiments themselves, becoming more efficient. Okay, now let's jump to a live demo. So as an admin, um, this role, I'm going to navigate to admin settings, can be assigned to each individual user or well, two way, ways. First, when a new user is invited, that invite flow, there's a new drop down where an admin can pick between editor and viewer. Okay, and this will be the role that will, will be assigned to the user that's invited at the user level. Another way of doing it is um, after the user has been invited and activated. Uh, one can go in here, there's a new edit button, uh, and open um, the user model, and the admin can pick between two values here, editor and viewer. Very straightforward. Okay. Now that we know how the new viewer role is assigned to a user, uh, how does it look for a user that has that role? Okay, um, here is how it looks. Um, if one navigates to feature flags, modifying actions like create feature flag are now disabled. Or if one goes to feature definition, um, feature definition is disabled. So no changes can be made here. Um, same is true for the metrics impact, of course. Uh, same for segment. Um, users that are viewers can create new segments or modify existing ones. Uh, or in the data hub, they can't start exports or download existing exports. Um, yeah, um, this is a very powerful new feature and especially catering to admins that want to secure um, their split implementation. Um, before we end this, a couple of limits. The viewer role is only available at our two highest tiers, the business tier and the enterprise tier. Um, and when a customer is downgrading to a lower tier developer or team, the users that have the viewer role will keep the viewer role assigned. Um, but the viewer role can't be assigned to new, to new users anymore. Um, so all pretty safe. Uh, we hope you enjoy this new role and make your onboarding uh, safer and are able to add more users to split.